I'm the same color as the sage. It's crazy. <laughs> I think the light's just reflecting off of me. I don't know. Yeah, maybe they just won't see me. Maybe that's the play. Soup has, like, incredible accuracy. Game Boy versus Good Brain. Yeah, that's true. All the colors are like this. I haven't seen a single item yet. Surely this uh, shrine will have some goods for me. There's two shrines. That's not what I want to see, actually. I mean, it is items, whatever. Alright. <laughs> the, the sentence that gets you in the most in trouble with the game is like, eh, I don't care what item it is or whatever. <laughs> the game's like, alright, buddy. The game aspect, uh, what does the chatter who dropped it, the aspect get? Yeah, they get to die. <laughs> There's actually a lot of stuff on the stage. Take it back. I'm going to put the capacitor in my rebar hand it though, so I can remember a little bit better. Yeah, that is what I want. Okay. But you still love your that was a beetle put to the actual test. Holding the fucking rebar launcher in my hand. If I were a crystal beetle cart. No. I wouldn't, I don't know. Ooh, nice. Is Overloading Worm? Maybe. Do flying guys in the distance have names? Oh, that's good to check. No, they don't. They deserve to die though. They deserve death. As do all things. I think those count as like rocks, you know what I mean? Like what are they the alligator sharks or whatever? I don't remember what they're called. Bird sharks, that's it is. Why do I keep calling them alligator sharks? What is that from? You didn't realize you could shoot those guys? Yeah. You can And it doesn't even give you anything. Just do it out of the uh the joy of, of killing. Ooh, there it is. I'm gonna play the other one again. It's nicer to me. Yeah, it is. Yeah, it is, dude. You know what? While we're here, just kill the bird sharks, actually. There's literally nothing spawning. It's actually insane. I'm right, gonna drink some water, though. <laughs> A beetle. Oh, yeah, we got, like, the entire beetle army. Good thing the director saved up credits to spawn in, uh, four blazing beetles. How does shipping request form work? Maybe I'm blind, but I just don't ever notice it doing anything. It spawns in a chest next stage for you. Gotta go find it. Gotta go on your scavenger hunt. Hmm. Um, sure. Oh, let me get random. Even the pennies would have been nicer. Won't be so bright. Yeah, and powerful. The brighter the character, the more powerful they are. I'm the first E2 with Burke yesterday. Congratulations, dude. On the climb. Okay, we did get two Void Cradles. Which is not bad. The The button is right there. It's a really good button for us. So, this is what the shipping request form is, by the way. Someone was asking. Beautiful. Oh, the sludge just there. Hey, man. Goodbye. Everyone's always a wisp. That's crazy. Oh, this is fine. Hey. I need a pot first, actually. Alright, Multi, show us what you got, buddy. Nice. It's crazy. That's the most useless thing I've ever seen. Hopeful, oh, please. Alright, what are the chances that we get another TC drone and have another horrible run of meal? Pretty high, I'd wager. I'm looking. I mean, not... We need some speed for our multi run, though, here. That's excellent. Four times the fucking effects. Or just like of a regular equipment, I mean, it's two times the effect of this. Smile. Ah, 
I don't know, I feel it, dude. I It's summer, actually. See how empty this map is right now? Where is it? <laughs> Adding Zerk and hey buddy, like, you're up again, dude. <laughs> Egg is definitely worth our time. Definitely, definitely. Nice. Does Pump applying more stacks of bleed uh, make it worth on a character like Multi, or is it better to go damage? Procturing stuff, watch a sticky bomb. Well, I think bleed's already worth it on a character like Multi a lot of the time. If you have a nail gun. Ooh, nice. If I'll start it now. I can't mark it. Mocha. There was a Scrapper too, we're gonna go into Mocha. This one feels so much better than the last one actually. One Void changing the entire run. I see Pump is an additional 0.2 proc coefficient, but I often forget that it's 40% damage, which is pretty significant. Yeah, it is very, very good. Well, if they made an action RPG replay the Providence or something, I would not be mad. Like, they could have done so many better things with the IP than just a... Uh, gotcha game mobile? So the hostile rules might get more updates and risk of rain returns. Yeah. Do you think any of the multi-primary options are bad? I think um, Scrap is honestly the worst at what it tries to do. Because I think Nailgun's really good at what it wants to do, same with Rebar. Even Saw, even though it's like not an amazing option all the time, for what it does, it does it really well. Scrap is an AoE kind of long-range option, just kind of falls short. Saw is going to get worse in every way except for raw damage. I mean, it has a way better proc coefficient. Well, I mean, it's fun, you know. It can be. It also opens up the ability to do uh, the nail gun accuracy tech, which is kind of niche and cool in itself. But, you know, it's not like amazing. I'm not going to sit here and be like, oh, yeah, it's all so fucking good, guys. But, like, at what it. Listen, like, it wanted to be kind of like a meme, you know? Like, they knew it wasn't going to be like a, a use all kind of option. But it's better at what it does than what the scrap does, so. Are you shuriken? Oh yeah, dude, shuriken on saw is actually fucking crazy. You can spam that. It's like better than almost any of one. Our whip is big value. Yeah, we're not going to need too much more speed after um, this. Do you think they designed Diablo Strike as a meme that were true power? No. I think they're really, they knew how good it was. Damage tips for avoiding damage as smirk. I find them always popping my elixirs and playing them. I bet you that you're staying in combat too long. The trick with all melee survivors is to get in and then get out and then get back in. Same with loader. Like if I'm just like in the middle of all of the enemies and just stay there while punching, I'm gonna just die. A loader can swing in and out and punch their enemies and stuff. You should be doing the same with Merc. I think it was intentional to cook Diablo. That was not intentional at all. Um, okay, let's get rid of this stuff. I don't know why I got rid of that. That was actually not good to get rid of. It's fine though, it's not helping anybody here. I don't really think I'm gonna need the chrono. I might not need the red whip, but we'll see until after we print. That's grabbing the pistol. Yeah, I don't know. I just fucked up. I regretted it immediately. I was just so used to playing Artie earlier. I don't know. I want to get rid of another green. It might be Shorm. Shorm might have to take the axe. Well, yeah. I don't want to attack speed with them. Um, Let's a little bit here, actually. Afterburner? No thanks, actually. It's a threshold for this guy to spawn here. Uh, you gotta get here around like 30. Blasted? I do not want coils. There it is. Dude, you're insane, what the fuck? I knew he was here, but this guy. What the fuck is this spawn? Nicholas, fuck you, buddy. Back at mag, no thank you. It's actually going pretty well. I think we just need some defensive options here and then we're good. We have the feather, we have the speed. Damage is all right. Why are the rocks censored? That's funny. <laughs> I wonder what uh, texture that is. I think rock textures are just kind of like that. And it's like when they're shiny, it just like shows how 
They are. They're Valheim rocks. I was talking about that game the other day with somebody, and uh, I like it in concept, but man, it is so grindy for literally no reason at all. Like, you have to play it with just like a bunch of inventory mods and shit to have an enjoyable experience. Why? Why? Why do I need to do that? Mine's <laughs> some copper, yeah, for 40 hours. I don't wait for possible card. Has not been in the game long enough Sadie was alive yet? Ooh, that's a good point. When did Stadia die? I still remember the funniest article I was ever shown. It's the Google Stadia article where the uh, the game journalist did a review of Google Stadia, and in their review they said uh, this was the whole paper, by the way, that they would not use Google Stadia because they would have to test it out in public in a cafe, and they looked like a nerd, so they didn't test it, and that was the article. Game journalism is, like, a disease, actually. Like, it seems pretty cool, and then, you know, you could theoretically do all this stuff. But, uh, I won't ever use it. And I won't ever tell you how it is. <laughs> okay, thank you. Nice. It'll be nice to have two eggs during phase four as well, in case you need them. What was in the point of Stadia? To enter the new uh, realm of cloud gaming. Which... <laughs> yeah. Aren't there other services that do that that are still alive? Oh, we'll watch for her. I don't know. Didn't the video have one? Yeah, the, the fucking problem with cloud gaming is obvious to every single person who's ever played a game though, which is the problem of uh, King. You are sending a button input to a computer and it's sending what happens back. That's crazy. And I think like, I don't remember who, I think it was Nvidia or Google or somebody. I think it might've been Google. Uh, they were like, yeah, we to combat this problem, we have the AI of Sadia actually play the game for you or predict your inputs. Like, dude, what the fuck? Why am I even playing a game? What, <laughs> what are we doing, dude? What do I want? I set a timeout. I didn't really want any of those. I could have gone after the elephant instead of the capacitor, but I don't know. Yes. Flavor screen 2 on stadium, then the AI makes him pick up the happiest mask of checking for a recycler. They're like, no, turn around! <laughs> But they were doing it for, um, like, fighting games and shit, too. Like, you can play Street Fighter, and then we'll have the AI play for you. And it's like, no one even fucking batted an eye. Whatever, okay. How game will only work if you're A, sitting inside the server room, or B, someone, uh, cracks instantaneous server connections? Yeah, which... <laughs> Is the Street Fighter AI thing was just for local play? Oh, it wasn't? Okay. I mean, I didn't look into it or anything. I was just like, that's so crazy. Imagine you're, like, at, a, like, a local tournament. <laughs> this guy's, like... Uh, I can't show up today. I'm gonna log in using Stadia for the tournament. <laughs> uh, but it's good. Call it turret. Get corrupted and insta killed you. Yeah, you got owned, man. You gotta be more careful. Can definitely happen. Uh, I'm gonna actually keep the what was in PSG. I don't know. Let's print four. All right, Satan's here. Satan has a name. Sorry. Dunes, what up, buddy? I'm gonna try to stun you to hell. Okay. Sorry, comment. You <laughs> keep saying that. Well, I feel like you're the only one I'm apologizing to, so maybe we should look at the positive of the situation. I'm gonna snipe this guy. Bye bye I don't know who that was, but uh, you got him, sorry. It somehow feels more personal. <laughs> a knife with your name on it. It also says sorry on it. Exclusively pirate AAA game. There is no reason for uh, AAA games to be as expensive alongside uh, 30 different microtransaction store currencies. For what? Eight hours of gameplay, and it's like not even that good gameplay. All right, guys, 
I can buy an indie game for 10 bucks and play it for a thousand hours and enjoy it. I buy a AAA game for $70, not including everything else, and I play it for like nine max. And it's not because like I don't want, yeah, it's, it's not fun enough. Huh? Kept 50 lunar coins for 25 bucks. The Gearbox Future, dude. Never bought a game over $30 and I have that. I will in the future. There's almost no reason to. I feel like every $6 game I've bought in the past uh, 10 years, which has been like two or three max, uh, has not been worth it. I think we're good to go. There's no equipment on this map at all. Oh, was, okay, Baldur's Gate was actually, well, it's not a AAA game, so never mind. Yeah, I mean, you almost baited me into thinking it was. Yeah, I saw 200 hours of, out of Cyberpunk. Okay. On release, how many did you get? I got like 70 hours by it then. Did you pay full price? I think that's all. That also kind of like matters because like once they start updating the game, they don't actually leave it at full price or. Whatever. <laughs> I don't. Probably read Elden Ring, but would buy if I had money. That's fair. I've heard people actually like Elden Ring. I think Elden Ring was an example of one people got a good a lot of time out of. I just never played it, so I didn't think about it. But I would say people enjoyed it a lot. Ah, it's so rare, dude. It's so rare. Elden Ring is Enigma and AAA gaming, true. I would say very few games are like that though. Played Minesweeper? Minesweeper's alright. It's a little simple though. Have you played a Minesweeper variant of Sudoku? That was pretty fun. Okay, I tried to hide up here, dude. That's crazy. One guess, huh? You played a Minesweeper variant of Sudoku? That has to be the nerdiest shit I've ever heard. Yeah, it was awesome. It's my favorite. I love variant Sudoku's. Alright, I think we're good to go. Oh, shit. We're not good to go, actually. Uh, so long as my only red, so I guess it doesn't matter. Blue Wisp. You can skip fillers, so it's not a big deal. Uh, what's my right scrap at? Two. I don't think I really need this. I'm gonna leave it at that, probably. Do you think that not finishing runs is a bad habit? Are you using proper save through a run just because? I do this, that's why I'm asking. Probably. I mean, you're teaching yourself to not very, not focus very hard for long periods of time, I guess. I don't know. But I mean, it's fine. It's like, you can do whatever you want. If you finish your runs ever, that's fine. <laughs> you know? Another Frelic? That's crazy. Uh, focus Crystal. That's terrible. We can get a Feather. I might just get all focus crystals actually. It's just where our life is at. That does some damage. <laughs> I might get another one of these actually. That kind of sucks. Oh, the shorm! Shit. Oh, sorry, here. Perfect. Not the one who experiences mass performance tips whenever Presser Look is active, or is my PC just awful? I would suggest getting JP's AB effect options and turning off the effect of uh, Relic. Because that will save you a lot. Your PC is bad enough that <laughs> you have to. I mean, it, I just find it looks annoying, so I use it. It wasn't. Kami, what up?
fun. Again? That's crazy luck. Alright, I have egg. I have egg. That was just a very, not very hard fight at all, actually. That's a clean run, actually, all the way through. We got speed, we got damage. Honestly, it was just the early plump, to be honest, in the bands, maybe. How do you know which portal to go through? You just gotta memorize them. You'll map them out if you play enough. 